It's BMX Freestyle, and it's taking off literally half pipe, ramp riding action has to be the highest adrenaline rush you can get on a bicycle. We are 95 kilometers west southwest of Toronto here at the University of Waterloo campus. It is round number one of the two hip King of Birds series, first time ever in Canada, and we have eight of the world's best ramp riders in action. four months he's back good to have him back we have the series champion the last two years flying brian blyther from ontario california and one man that all eyes have been watching 17 year old sensation from oklahoma matt hoffman they call him the condor and he is fearless the riders took turns in the event to impress the three judges positioned on one side of the ramp the riders are scored accordingly to the smoothness and flow of their routine, variety of the tricks, and the overall radical performance. Let's take a look at what the riders did earlier in the contest. John Yervich, Canada's only pro ramp rider, 18 years old, Calgary, Alberta, Canada, 12th grade. He wants to become an architect. He's riding very cautiously in this event because of a right broken collarbone he did a month ago where he fell 23 and a half feet. Then came Joe Johnson, 19 years old, Lucadia, California, originally from the East Coast, a two-year pro, ranked number two in the world, and he's known for his tail whips and his double tail whips. Watch this aerial move. The crowd loves it, and the judges score high. The pterodactyl, Brian Blyther, 20 years old, Ontario, California. He is the defending two-hip champion. He's won four events in 87, four in 88 known for his chicken air and his big 540s and he's the only one to really come close to pulling off the incredible 900. Then came Dave Volker, Lord Volker they call him, 22 years old, Santee, California, 13 amateur events in 1987, now he's a pro and he's getting big air. Lots of rubber band moves, incredible no-handed fakie right there, he's very impressive. Overall, the best freestyle in the world, both flatland and ramp, is Dennis McCoy, 22 years old, Kansas City, Missouri. The real McCoy, fourth year pro, numerous titles. Dino DeLuca, 21 years old, Camarillo, California, a rookie pro, four years as an amateur. In fact, last year he won seven amateur events. And now he's going for the big money. Big look down move right there, very flashy. The Condor, Matt Hoffman, 17 years old, out of Edmond, Oklahoma, riding with a broken right thumb. This is his first full year as a pro, but his amateur career, five years as an amateur career, was flawless. Undefeated two-hip amateur champion, now in his second pro event, and he's undefeated as a pro. His variations in the air are incredible. No handers, no footers, Indian airs, there's a candy bar, cross-up whip, the guy is something. Finally comes Ron Wilkerson, two-hip Ron, they call him, 23 years old, out of Lucadia, California. The six-year pro is the promoter of the two-hip series. Famous for his lip tricks and wild drop-ins, the 1988 Freestyle of the Year has been out for four months, but he's back in action today, first time on the pro ramp. We are set for the final run and dropping in John Yorovich from Alberta, Canada. Again, this man is riding with a right broken collar mode. He did that a month ago in an indoor ramp in Alberta where he was getting 13, 14 feet above the top of the ramp, meaning he fell 23 and a half feet. So he's riding quite conservatively here. There's a one-hander to the low side. Canada's only pro ramp rider right now, but they have several great amateurs. And John out here just getting in a little practice and he pulls off to save his shoulder. Good job, though. Here's Joe Johnson now, the second year pro, and before that, he was three years on the amateur ramp scene, living in Lucadia, California. Look at the air he's getting now. Beautiful can-can move. Look down. Rubber band, look back. He's got a whole bag of tricks across that channel there. If you notice, there's a, uh, there's a coping grind on his pedals. A disaster move. A 180 out, right onto the sprocket. Now he's setting up. Judges are taking note. Everything he's doing, he's catching his breath here. He's setting up for a big move. He likes this side of the ramp. Here it comes. 
It is a tail whip, and he pulls it off flawlessly, and he's got to be pumped about that. And he tries a double, and he pulls it off. Joe Johnson with a double tail whip air. Incredible move for his final run here. Let's take a look one more time, slow motion. One, two, right foot onto the frame. He pulls it off. Brian Blyther drops in, 20 years old, Ontario, California. The four-year pro, two-time defending pro champion here on the ramps. And look at the chicken air. A solid 20 feet above the floor here. Setting up for some moves there. And a 540 across the channel. It looked like in slow motion there is a 50-50 grind and an unusual drop in there. Again, across the channel, setting up. Blyther with a manual rollout back in. Look at this, Brian Blyther. Big air, now he performs his lip tricks. Whoa! He survived, not sure exactly what that was. Blyther now. Tries a 900 and he just about pulls it off. Brian Blyther limping to his bike. Hopefully he's okay, wearing the full safety gear. He's off, attempted the 900, did not pull it off. The crowd loved that attempt. Next up, Dave Volker, 22 years old, Santee, California. Lord Volker, three years in as, as an amateur, now right pro. He won 13 amateur events last year. Good enough incentive to make the big money. Look at that move. Big aerial moves, nice can-can. Very smooth, very flashy across the channel. There it is, a 540 flawless. A big aerial 360 with his bike. He pulls it off, setting up one more time. He tries the 900 and just about pulls it off. Incentive from Brian Blyther. He tries the 900. The crowd loves it. Now it's Dennis McCoy, drops in quickly, 22 years old, Kansas City, Missouri. The crowd is at a fever pitch and the riders are going for it. The fourth year pro has many titles, both flatland and ramp, and combination overall titles. Nice candy bar, one foot over that handlebar frame. Little Indian Air attempt. Big fly, no, he was trying a 540 and he comes down short. He does not mix a transition. Now you know Dennis has done that. Wearing the full safety gear, he is okay. He's taken a pounding before, but he is a top pro. Dennis waves to the crowd. That 540 coming up short, hitting the lip, he goes down, but a great performance. And next up, dropping in, Dino DeLuca. His personal manager, Magoo, calls him Disco Dino. 21 years old, Camarillo, California. And he has got a lot of flash and gets big air on that chrome bike. No hander. Setting up one more time. He likes the other side of the ramp, it looks like. Nice little cross up. Dino DeLuca. With a can-can, a quick one. Dino DeLuca, the crowd is chanting. Look back, snap. Setting up again. One footer. One footer, one hander. And Dino DeLuca. Woo, rubber band snap. Let's see if he's gonna call it a day or no. Look at this lip trick. Going for the pedal picker drop in. Let's see if he makes it. He pulls it off. And it looks like he's going to continue. Dino DeLuca with another unusual drop in. Great attempt. He's okay. The crowd loves it, but he did not pull it off. Nonetheless, a fantastic run for Dino DeLuca. Now, Ron Wilkerson. Four months ago, he attempted a nothing air and crashed and was unconscious for several days. Known for his incredible lip tricks and drop ins. This is two hip Ron Wilkerson from Lucadia, California. Well, he's been practicing one month and he's back on the pro ramps and he's promoting the two hip series. Look at this, manual drops back in. A wild man on the lip tricks, fearless. 
No footer, no hander. Great variation. Whoa. No footer, midair. Beautiful disaster. No hander as he pulls that off. The crowd loves it. Gets to the edge, drops back in one more time. It's good to have Ron Wilkerson back in action. Attempts a 540, maybe a 900. We're not sure. The bike pulls off a 900. Ron with a big smile underneath that full face helmet. The crowd loves it, though. Ron Wilkerson. Now, the crowd has been waiting for this man. Finally, we see Matt Hoffman, 17 years old, Edmond, Oklahoma. How can he better the previous performances by the seven other pros? Let's take a look. Look at the air he's getting. Huge can-can, slow motion air. No hand or one footer. Indian air, the crowd is loving it. Again, riding with a broken right thumb. Undefeated as a pro. He tries a 900 and goes down. Going for the big win, he goes for a 900. Never attempted this move before. He told me earlier, he says, yeah, I don't think I'll do it. And he tried it. Nobody has completed the 900 air ever. He's back up on the ramp. He pulls it off. Matt Hoffman pulls it off. The 900 air. The crowd goes crazy. Never in the history of ramp freestyle action have we seen such an incredible performance. Matt Hoffman, 17 years old. His second event as a pro. He attempts a 900. This is the second attempt ever, and he pulls it off. And the final results of today's two-hip contest, winning, obviously, Matt Hoffman, the Condor. Coming in second, Brian Blyther. Third, Joe Johnson. Fourth, Dave Volker. And rounding out the top five, Dino DeLuca. Again, Matt Hoffman doing the impossible for so many years, and now it is possible. The 900-degree aerial turn. Congratulations to the young 17-year-old, Matt Hoffman.